Hi, and welcome to the CertMic Practice Test Question of the Week, where I bring you a question that you might find on your next cybersecurity certification exam, and then explain my thought process as I answer that question. This week's question is about certificate revocation. Let's take a look. Which one of the following mechanisms offers the most immediate way to invalidate a compromised digital certificate? Is it using OCSP, using a CRL, changing the private key, or changing the public key? Let me give you a moment to think about that, and then I'll explain the correct answer. I release these questions once a week for members of my free CertMic study groups. There's a group covering each of the major cybersecurity certifications. If you're working on your next certification, you can learn more at certmic.com. We can immediately eliminate two of the answers here because changing the keys associated with a certificate would not invalidate the certificate, as an imposter would still be able to use the certificate with the old keys. So we know that the two answers suggesting changing keys are not correct. The two possible methods for invalidating a digital certificate are adding it to a certificate revocation list, a CRL, or using the Online Certificate Status Protocol, OCSP. Of these two methods, OCSP works immediately, while using a CRL has a time delay, making OCSP our correct answer here. Now, if you found this question helpful, please click the like button below and consider subscribing to my channel for more cybersecurity content. Thank you.